Yo, what up? So, I'm currently doing the editing for this video. I just realized I did not film a very good intro at all. So just to give you guys some background of what's going on here. So me and Quam, we were deciding to go fish a lake we've never fished before. It was a two hour drive from my house. Um, and we were just going off a whim. So, we decided to go do this. Uh, our original plan was to go camp there. We were going to leave Friday night as soon as I got off work. And then we were going to run down and spend the night and fish probably the whole weekend. Well, then plans changed. Quam got a seatbelt ticket because he was staring at an undercover cop. So that was funny, but uh, he decided not to go. And then around like eight o'clock, we're like, let's just go down the night, dude. Let's just fish all tomorrow. And that's what we decided to do. So <laughs> we decided to do that. He got to my house at 11.45 p.m. We drove there. We got there at 2.30. <laughs> got like two hours, to maybe three hours of sleep. Just was not feeling it, but we went out and fished anyways. Did pretty decent, did a little kitchen cook. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Looked out the window and what did I see? It's a quam that is pulled up. Can't see it there, but his truck lights are shining on my grass. I'ma go yell at him to get off my property. Yeah, true. It'll be interesting. We're probably gonna get like two hours of sleep, maybe three. You gotta think though, we'll have that time to like wake up, not be rushed. Yeah, true. You know? True. Hopefully, we'll catch some fish. Loser! <laughs> Regular? <laughs> Damn, saucy be raw. Backwards, they're gonna call me out. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, bro. They're calling me, they're gonna go call me out, dude. <laughs> if you didn't think I was tired, me and Quan, we stopped here to get gas, right? Went to a Maverick to go get some food because this place is closed. And uh, I get there, I go to pay. I'm like, where's my card? So luckily, I paid my other card, but uh, came back to that gas station we're at. It's right there. I'm not showing you guys my card number. Actually, it's on the back, so you know. <laughs> nice, solid. <laughs> It's 6.30 now. We woke up like an hour and a half ago. We've just been dilly-dallying because I've been super freaking... Oh! <laughs> but I've been dilly-dallying because uh, I was just super tired this morning. But yeah. I'm gonna go walk over here a ways because Quam doesn't want to take his truck off-road and... Uh... Whew, we'll go see if we can go catch some fish. Alright everybody. Good morning. Um, it is... June 3rd. I'm out here at a lake I've never fished before with my boy Quam. Looks like we could maybe catch some fish today. I've seen a couple jumping. What's probably be best is like a bobber setup, but I really don't want to do that. I kind of want to just do like a spinner. So we're going to start with a spinner, see how it works. So I think I've got like maybe 10 or 15 pound monofilament mainline here. And I'm going to put like maybe 10 pound mono as a leader. Hopefully we can catch a couple fish. But just given the fact that fish are surfacing, I'm gonna start off with a fly. I'd say. Little seven foot rod, little light action boy. You're like pulling him in, he's probably a dinkle. He probably oh, the way he grabbed it though, dude. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> That's a tank, bro. <laughs> oh, he's not a bad one, dude. He's healthy. That's probably eating size there. I think right, white, red, pink. What color? 
Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. That's just the smallest one ever. I don't think he's still on it though. <laughs> I'm getting hit. Little bites, yeah, but. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's got it. You feel that tension, we'll give it to him. This might be a better one. Yeah, he might just be the same size as yours. He doesn't feel huge. I don't like him going into these trees right here, though. Oh, he might be a big one. Oh, he ain't, he ain't that big. <laughs> Want to net him real quick, though? You got to get it in the water, boy. <laughs> Thanks. Eat her or not? Yeah, we can eat her. New lure time. <laughs> oh, sh Either like hit a rock or might have had a little bit of a tug there. Might have just hit a rock, I don't know, because it, well, well then, it looked like it had flipped up on itself, which is not good, but maybe not, we'll see. I'll recast it though. Try again. Yeah, I think I'm just bumping it along rocks and what. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm done. Got myself a first snag of this this lake, and it's it's a good one. She's probably gonna come off. Only got about one option. Let's just see. Oh yeah, this is gonna snap. Yep, it snapped. There goes a five, eh, probably seven dollar lure actually. That's too bad. Move on. Yeah, but I want to fish a little bit longer. Not like. Take those fish back and start them. All right. Might want to put my split shots like right up at the top. That way, that marabou can have like really natural action, and then those split shots will just help me cast it farther. And I mean, it'll sink the marabou quicker too, but. As long as I'm not right at the tip, I think it'll give the marabou a little bit more natural action. Which could be what these fish might be wanting, you know. But never know. We'll see. <laughs> oh, I love catching fish on lures, man! <laughs> Oh man, that is fun. Little guy, but hey, I love catching fish on lures. This is such an awesome feeling because you get to feel the whole report. Oh man, that's not a bad one. I mean, he's not big. He's maybe 15 inches, somewhere in there. What a beautiful fish. He's probably, yeah, probably somewhere right in that range of size. Barely even hooked right in the top of the jaw. Exactly what we like to see. 
I'll let him revive himself for a minute in the net. We'll get a video of him. Wet my hand real quick. And we'll show him off for the camera here. He's freaking thick. Little guy. Welcome to go now. Get that sediment out of his lips. See you later, buddy. Thanks for playing. That's fun. Thanks for playing. That's fun. Oh, that was awesome. I needed that. I needed to hook up on a on a lure. It's been a long time since I felt that. I've been doing a lot of bait fishing, which is fun, but. Man, getting a hook up on a, a lure, it's a different feeling. <laughs> yeah, we'll fast forward here. We got the fish. And we cooking them up. Bro, that knife can dull, huh? It is very dull. It's what, just what? like a fish rub that I got. Gotcha. Oh, damn. It's a rub, you gotta... And not got much like sodium or nothing? Or what? I don't even know. It's gonna taste good though, too. I'm gonna put... Couple pieces of butter under. Oh, pieces on top. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> that diver, they didn't think this morning. I'm looking forward to Dude, it. Yeah, this should be good regardless because we're going to be hungry. Oh, yeah. I just wanted to get this out of the way, though. All right, bud. Better sacrifice your hand if that thing drops. Oh, damn straight. Here, <laughs> <laughs> we're observing the final product. The low level. Oh. What? The mother is sizzling, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like crazy. Oh, yeah. It's boiling. This means it's frying in there. <laughs> is that what that means? <laughs> oh, it smells good. Good boss. No one's truth, brother. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. <laughs> that looks good, bro. <laughs> Shouldn't even done. <laughs> That's more than done, bro. How hot is it? I don't know. You tell me. Yeah, that's that's done. I even have a thermostat if you don't trust it. Thermostat? Yeah. I mean, a thermometer? <laughs> oh, yeah. Thermometer. <laughs> oh, brother. That's more than done. We're in Celsius. Oh, change it to Fahrenheit. Either right. way, though, 200 Celsius, it's way, that's way done. That was 23.9 Celsius. We're at 150. Right we're 160. Yeah, we're good. Ooh, yeah. That should be looking good. That's good. That tastes good. So has a fishy taste, but it's good. Do you have bones? Maybe. I haven't bit any yet. It's hot. Yeah, it's pretty good. Mm. Not too fishy. Not horrible at all. And like that rub really comes. It's a right good off. thing we did a lot. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, so this stuff. The, do you know like what kind of brand of seasoning you put on it or just um, I, I can send you I can send you a, I'll send it to you when I get home I might put a link in the description or something but we just got like some, some fish rub it's on Traeger it Traeger brand and butter some it's, Traeger fish rub it's good we're out here we got the fish done let you guys see what we're working with that's the second fillets alright I just whipped out the next fillet I gotta show y'all Boom. Put that on a cracker door. <laughs> All right, y'all. We are going to a different spot. I'm gonna wreck um, to go and catch possibly my first brook trout ever. <laughs> Dude, if we catch my first brook trout ever and then break my tailgate in the same sentence. Oh, okay. We're good. But. Yeah, that'd be an awesome video. Catch and cook and my first brookie in the same video. Cream!
<laughs> what he said. <laughs> Look at this stuff. Ha 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 ha!